Welcome to Dave Loves Games. I'm Dave. Last time we did the tutorial and the starting impressions of Vader Empires 4. Today I want to get started with these campaigns. We have the Norman campaign starting in 1066. The Battle of Hastings. In 1066, William of Normandy set out to wrest the Kingdom of England from his Anglo-Saxon rival. Only one man could be king. All right, let's have a look at how these uh, these campaign missions play. I was a little disappointed there was no intro cinematic, but I can see unlockable videos that I assume we, we get at certain points in the campaign. So hopefully those videos are Mwah. All right, select the campaign. Difficult is a story mode. Why would you have a story mode in an RTS? Um, all right, let's go intermediate to start with. Let's go intermediate. Norman Conquest. Okay, so they, they've got full cinematics for the history, campaign. But none on the land. They just went out and filmed in a place in England. This is the site of the Battle of Hastings. Yeah. After almost a thousand years, no traces of the bloody conflict can be seen. But here, the fate of England turns. Oh, that's cool. It's AR. where a king was killed, and his victor claimed the throne. That's really cool. AR. So they, uh, it seems like they're they're leaning October into 14th, the education side of Age of Empires, which is really cool. I actually learned a butt ton of you know um, about history day, from Age of Empires too. Thanks to this. So that's really cool. I'm really glad the to see that. Tapestry carefully preserved illustrated record of events it shows the main players harold the newly crowned anglo-saxon king of england and his challenger william duke of normandy william is gonna be good it's gonna be good time promised him the crown so he assembled an army and prepared to sail to england to fight king harold for the throne. But a storm. Damn, they made this dramatic. Plans. Meanwhile, Harold discovered that a Viking invasion had landed in the north. Another threat to his crown. So he raced to fight them. In France, William waited for the right conditions to sail across the Channel to England. The weather cleared. He that looks really cool. That looked really cool. 250 miles north, Harold had defeated the Vikings. Oh, but now, hearing of William's we arrival, are here now. his army sped south. Thank you, Vikings, for weakening down my enemy. It At should make my life morning. much more easy. On this hill, William's Norman army were ready to do battle with Harold's Anglo-Saxon men. The stage was that set. That's really cool. And up for grabs, England itself. That was really cool. Okay, yeah. So they're putting in they're putting in the top-notch quality all the campaign videos i can forgive them for their lack of intro cinematic also yeah heavily leaning into the education side like it was showing i assume that tapestry they found um well like the the scroll thing is in a museum somewhere that's where it looked like that's awesome that's kind of really cool and i love i love the uh the overlay of the this is the agile place this happened and we're putting some like um i said ar but ar is probably not the right word for it um Troops on top. That's really cool. That's really sweet. Send Luck Hill, 1066. On October 14th, 1066. William and it actually looks like that hill. That's really cool. At the base of a hill. The high ground belonged to King Harold of England and his Anglo Saxon army. They. That. Here, on this hilltop, 
the fate of England would be decided. This looks like that hill that they just filmed. Did they like remake the maps based on the actual location? Because that would be mint. I can't tell that close, but maybe someone else can. All right, we're just attacking the army. I assume I don't want you to die, so you can. No, no, no! <laughs> first charge launching a direct assault on the shield wall. I want I want access to my archers okay they just have abilities oh, okay maybe I really want all right get up there bro though William's army fought fiercely against the shield wall it would not yield as one man fell another took his place are these Both guys even taking damage type formation made for a near impenetrable barrier yes Realizing I know this his army could not break the shield wall William called for a retreat. Okay. Ah, uh, run away! Run away! William's no, run! retreat was working. The Anglo-Saxon army broke their shield wall formation, leaving gaps for William to make a move. Yes, all right. Feign a retreat. Okay, okay. Guys, you could let me in on your plan. If you let me in on your plan, I would know what's going on. You guys, you guys are going over here. Everyone, everyone together now, okay? Everyone together. Can I control the archers? The archers! No shoot them! Shield wall formation. William could pick them off as they charged. Kill the Saxons from the shield wall? We are. We're getting there, okay? We're getting there. What's this? Revive leader. Alright, yeah. Flank. Flank. They're holding a good wall here, but I need you to finish off these guys so you can flank the other guys. Alright, I'm gonna take half of you. I'll take half of you. You guys are gonna rejoin over here. You guys are gonna go over here. The rest of you, yeah. I don't need that many here. All right, you guys, go join the wall. Go join this wall. Go just join this wall. Come on, come on. Yeah, that's where we go. There we go. Yes. Break down their defenses. William, inspire your men. Oh yes, I got the archers now. Hell yeah. Had deployed rows of spearmen to push back the invaders. Now. But William had an answer. Yes. Sharp-eyed archers. Yes. Do I have elites of nothing? I've got the basic ones. Okay. All right, shoot the spearmen. Let's let's get some distance, a little bit of distance. All right, guys, keep keep that wall there. Don't let them come any closer. Protect the archers at all. Oh, there's more archers. Get in there. Get in there. All right, we got this. We got this team. Keep that wall sturdy. Norman men at arms reinforced William's army. Um, inventory. Okay. Injured leader. No. No. I let them go too far ahead, damn it. My spearmen, my men at arms are dying. Run away, William, run away. Oh, I did finally get reinforcements. I thought it said William's army, but I didn't see them. It just took a while, I guess, because I was still walking in, maybe. All right, yeah, men at arms, get in there. Get in there. Save your leader. He's going down. He's a champ. I'm glad they kept, like, I didn't like the the um, explorers and Adrian Vice 3 on a multiplier aspect. But kind of from a, um, ready to charge. kind of from a, um, a single player point. It makes really, it's really cool. All right, kill this guy. Whose sturdy pole arms could easily bring down a horse. Yeah, no, we're getting the spearmen. Get the spearmen. Get the spearmen. Yes, we got more men at arms. They're all coming. They're all coming. Yes, archers. Go, 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 go. Yes, William. Be inspiring. Yes, they walk in, so I didn't see them to begin with. Come on. Yes, get the spearmen. All the spearmen. Horses. Yes. In we go. of spearmen cleared from the field. William's cavalry was free to charge at the Anglo-Saxon yes. archers. Go, 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 go. And we go, everyone. Work together. Get these get these uh, archers. I'm going to split you up a little bit. Yes, half and half. Inventory, push in. There's more spearmen over here. You're going to need to have to deal with these, okay? We got this. We got this, Duke William. I will lead your army to victory. Their shield wall had been neutralized, and their numbers were dwindling. 
Right now, the only thing standing between William and Victory was King Harold himself. Oh, where's King Harold? Where's, oh, there's King Harold? I found King Harold. Wait, no, we have the we have the anime fight this. Harold, William, get out of here. The last of Harold's men encircled their king, prepared to lay down their lives. All right, William. His. Go, 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 go murder. Anime fight. No, that's not. Where are you, William? Anime fight. The big boss man. Yes. Have your sweet victory. No. Kill this guy. He doesn't want to fight you, William. Harold's a chicken. He's running away from your anime fight. Yeah, go get him. Go get him. It's a glorious battle. Did you get did you get him? Where is he? Oh, he's still alive, damn it. Just like yeah, come on, Duke William. Get him. Our troops are dwindling, man. Hurry up. Oh, actually, we got reinforcements. Sending the reinforcements. Come on, get him. Oh, Duke William, you're so close. Just get him. One more clean swipe. Come on. Yes, William. Yes. You legendary man. Winning the anime fight of history. King Harold had fallen. Hell yeah. In the confusion, some loyal soldiers fought to the death. While others scattered in panic. Yeah, good, good. Run away. We uh I did not do that efficiently at all. <laughs> I feel like my army suffered more than what they needed to. But we did it. Duke William had his moment. There was epic battle music in the background. He came in. 1v1 Harold was more like 1v50. But he did it. The Normans now, celebrated victory over the English king, but William's quest to rule England was just beginning. <laughs> Rip Harold, right here. R.I.P. Harold. Victory! Yes. I knew. We are going to conquer England. Novus Della, Novus Rex. In April 1066, a bright star with a long, streaked tail appeared in the night sky and burn for weeks. Its appearance coincided with the imminent invasion of England by William of Normandy. The William soldiers, waiting eagerly to set sail from Normandy, it seemed that the star's tail pointed directly at the Saxon king's castle in England. This was a divine guarantee of victory. It inspired the Normans' rallying cry, a Nova Stella, Nova Rex, a new star, a new king. By the time the star passed, the Saxon's king Harold lay dead killed at the Battle of Hastings, and William the Conqueror became King of England. That long-tailed star is depicted on the Bay York's tapestry, and we know it today as the Haley's Comet. I love all this history stuff. It's really cool. We already watched this one, right? Yep. All right. I got progression? I forgot the record of the outro for that one. So here we are. I hope you enjoyed that first level of the campaign. It was kind of cool. We had an anime fight between Harold and William, going to be the Conqueror. I'm looking forward to the rest of this campaign. It should be a bunch of fun. The mixed reality cutscenes are best. I love them so much. Looking forward to what else this game has to offer. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit the like button. Maybe subscribe to see more content. Leave down a question in the bottom of something you want me to answer from Age Empires 4. I'll see if I can find out more information. Because I'm, I'm wanting to get really into this. Maybe get a little bit competitive. Maybe. We'll see. But that's it for now. I'll catch you later. Bye-bye!